Hi, this is Vision ML plugin for Houdini. Vision ML, or VML for short, is a collection of HDAs that will help you bring computer vision and machine learning data into Houdini. This is just the first inception of this tool and it was thought to be an expandable framework. VML is composed of two main pieces. The first one is the VML Streamer, a standalone plugin that uses UDP sockets to serve data through a network or a local machine and then a set of Houdini HDAs that are able to decode and transform that data into visuals. VML requires SetFX Labs to be installed and makes half use of the mockup string node in the raw UDP mode. Mockup string makes it possible for Houdini to receive byte arrays from VML Streamer. VML Streamer is open source, runs on both Windows and Linux, and binaries are shipped together with the Vision ML plugin. It is also based on open source technology like OpenCV and Google's MediaPipe. Let me show a demo with the most basic setup. We'll stream the webcam into Houdini. First, we launch the VML streamer from the tab menu. Once loaded, we add a new video stream type. In Houdini, we add a new mockup stream node and set the mode to raw UDP. Make sure the port matches VML streamer, then click connect. Data is now being received, but it needs the proper decoder. Let's add a new Vision ML video decoder. Nothing shows up still, and this is because Houdini is receiving a flat RGB array. It does not know yet how to rebuild the image or what was its initial resolution. You can manually enter image data on the palms, but preferably let's add a new info dictionary type of string. Info dictionary will send a Python dictionary with stuff like image resolution, image source, if it's a webcam or video file, and if it's a video file, what is the file name. Also, it's, it will send a list of all available streams coming out of VML Streamer. That way you know exactly what decoders you should use, even if the server machine is far away or VML Streamer is not directly accessible to you. Okay, so once the info dictionary is enabled, let's add another mockup string node to receive the data. Set the matching port and click connect. Now add a dictionary decoder and plug that into the second input of the video decoder. It will now use the incoming data to properly rebuild the image. All image conversions make use of OpenCL nodes for better performance. MediaPipe is a Google product that serves machine learning solutions like hand, body and face tracking landmarks. VML Streamer includes those three options as string types. Here are some examples. Please note that MediaPipe inference is GPU accelerated on Linux machines and when I recorded those videos my GPU took a great hit from screen capture, which increases the frequency of dropped frames during the detection phase. The experience is much smoother on a regular use. This is Vision ML. Our HJs are fully documented. Please check the help cards and download the sample scene in the Side Effects Tech Art Challenge forum post. Also, feel free to download VML Streamer source code from GitHub. There, you'll find more info on how to install and customize the program with your own stream types. Thanks for watching.